there's a high chance you're looking at a screen of some kind for the majority of your day. And that makes you tired. More specifically, it makes your eyes tired. We have six ways you can prevent computer eye strain. So let's talk about it. Number one, blink more. Okay, so the actual solution is a little more complicated than that, but in the end, blinking more often can really help. Even those minute flashes where your eyes are covered give your brain a chance to rest. Additionally, blinking keeps your eyes lubricated. Not blinking means that your eyes will dry out more often. If that's something you've noticed bothering you, then definitely get some eye drops to keep at your desk to moisturize them often. Number two, change your font color, size, and family. You probably know that what font you choose makes a drastic impact on how much eye strain you endure. Many font families are not ideal for constant and repeated use. What looks great in a screenshot might not work for an eight hour shift of programming. The kerning, spacing, and even the shape of various fonts can increase readability. On top of that, color and size can be one of the largest factors of preventing eye strain. If you have a high resolution monitor, there's a good chance that your default font size is pretty small and a lot of what you're reading online might be low contrast. When this is the case, our eyes have to work overtime. So to fix that, increase the default font sizes. Number three, turn your brightness down. Whether it's a phone screen, laptop, or the circle of computer monitors you have around you, the brightness is probably way too high. This strains your eyes at an accelerated rate. You will need to find the balance of brightness that works for you. Number four, dark and reader modes. You also have access to dark mode on various platforms like Mac OS and iOS and even apps. This gives you a darker, less bright screen with a decent contrast ratio of lighter text on darker backgrounds. It's easier on the eyes in both daytime and in darker environments. You can also try programs like Dark Reader to make any website or app appear in dark mode, whether they support it natively or not. Number five, consider your posture. Where you are in relation to your screen plays a pretty big role in eye strain too. You want to be looking at your monitor front on at eye level. You shouldn't have to look up or down to see it. Not only is that bad for your posture, but most screens have a slightly different look from various angles, colors shift a little, glare hits it differently, and so on. You also want to make sure that you're at the right distance away from your monitor. Generally, you want to be able to just reach out and touch the screen with the tip of your finger from your neutral sitting position. If you keep it at this distance, you can save your eyes motion and wear. Sitting too close to the screen won't make you go blind, unlike what our parents told us when we were kids, but it can make your eyes work overtime, and that leads to easily preventable eye strain. And finally, number six, use everything anti-blue. Most phones these days have night mode, which effectively adjusts the color temperature of the screen after certain hours. You can adjust them for any hour or intensity that works for you. It may seem a little odd, but you get used to it quickly, and it does make long hours easier and less taxing. There's also a program called Flux that does this for your computer as well. Additionally, there are blue light filters you can hook to your monitor, or you can buy special computer glasses that filter out the light too, which you can get with no prescription. If you follow these six steps, you should be able to reduce your eye strain dramatically. If you enjoyed this video and can actually see the like button, definitely click it and subscribe for more content. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.